start a video by playing music. I don't know whether it's going to be a Q&A or whether it's going to be a story time. I think I'm going to film the both of them, so I'll start off with my story time. So this takes place on like one of the last Fridays in February, I believe. Give me one moment. February 24th? That sounds about right, I think. Yeah. February 24th. I was in a hospital in Cardiff and it was like 8 in the morning and I was getting ready to go to theatre because I was having a bronchoscopy. Now, um, if you don't know what a bronchoscopy is, it's basically a little tiny camera that they put down your throat and uh, for me they were doing it in my lungs. I don't know whether it's called a different thing for other body bits, but whatever. Um, and it goes into your lungs and then they do a bit of looking around your lungs to see what's there and they take samples and they wash out your lungs a bit and whatever. It, w it was all going well to start off with so I went down to theatre in like sort of the waiting area I guess. Um, they took me from the ward down there in a wheelchair. I was then transferred to a bed and then they moved the bed from the sort of waiting area into um, where I was going to be put under. So they were asking questions, just like the usual things like name, date of birth, address and things like that. Doing my SATs, they were doing blood pressure and then they were like okay now we're going to put the drugs in and then you're going to go to sleep. Um, so we're just going to put them in. So they put them in and I fell asleep and then that is basically the last thing I can remember. Um, cut to maybe a few hours later and I'm waking up in the sort of recovery bit, like after you wake up. Um, so I wake up there and I'm there and I'm in pain. Because I can, I can clearly remember having this done back in 2015 which was just like a day or so before my 16th birthday and I can remember being like waking up and I was I was fine I was like I just wanted to get on with things and I wanted to have food badly because I'd been starving all day but this one I was the first to go and have it done and I can remember waking up and just being in pain and it was horrible and I didn't really know what was wrong so then my mother comes in and she told me what happened in the middle of having this camera down my throat and into my lungs my body just sort of went you should cough like, you, re you really need to cough and I believe it says in the letter that they sent home I coughed aggressively so that's a thing that I did I then apparently uh, started going sick, which is horrible, ugh. And my sats plummeted and, you know, things were going wrong. Things were just going really wrong at this stage. Apparently there was people rushing in the room um, and they took the camera out and then they put a breathing tube down because I couldn't breathe, obviously. And I was apparently a bit of a mess and I can remember just being moved back up to the ward then and just I couldn't move like I just want I just I wasn't allowed to drink or eat for hours afterwards because I'd have the breathing tube down and they'd had to I th think the reason was they had to numb my throat or something like that um so I wasn't allowed to eat or drink because uh, my throat might not be able to cope with that because it's all numb and whatever and I was like I'm dying of this yeah and I was I spent most of my time in Cardiff just lying in bed in pain because I could not cope with it I was just it was horrible because you'd expect like a bad throat or something it's just like my entire torso and like hip and thigh area were just in pain for days afterwards 
I guess that's the story of how I nearly died. I, I don't know. Um, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed learning this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't. But Fionn obviously thinks she's important enough to interrupt my video. Let's see what she said. After the Revolutionary War, right. Aha! We were talking about Hercules Mulligan earlier. That's, that's mine and Fionn's conversations. Hamilton. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and hit the bell. And I will see you next Monday at 6. Bye!